one of the things I ask you to do is to create a dot plot. Uh, and in many ways, it's kind of the kindergarten dot plot where you dip your finger in the paint, and then every time you see that number come up, you add another another dot to that line. <clears throat> and um, there is a way. You don't have to draw it by hand. You can do it in Excel, and it's much, much quicker. So we have a data set here. So here's your data. Uh, it can be anything you want. And we're going to use this special formula right over here. All right. And this is what we're going to type into um, our Excel sheet. So we start with this. All right. So it's equals count. If count if and you can double click it and then you're going to set, set the range and we don't want this to change until um, we don't want it to change as we copy and paste it. So we're going to do dollar sign, which locks it in in the A category. And then we're going to do dollar sign two, which again locks it in uh, to the second uh, or to the, the two row. We're going to do colon dollar sign a2 comma and then the criteria is a2 all right and then we'll close our parenthesis and hit enter and it's going to come up one and basically what this is doing is counting how many times this number appears all right so now you can click this right click copy paste it all the way down and then you'll notice that you have uh, each time that it's duplicated, it increments, increments it by one. So now all you have to do is select your data. Now you want to select both. If you pick your title there, it should grab that as well. So you're going to click that, and then you're going to go up here to Insert, and then you're going to hit Recommended Charts. And it's going to default, because it's going to find the one that seems most appropriate, it's going to pick a scatter plot, and you hit OK, and then boom, you have the nice dot plot, uh, the kindergarten style dot plot. And you can go in and you can double click and you can change the, the size of this or anything that you, you happen to want. Um, but uh, that's how you do it.